Hey guys, it's Shea. Um, so I wanted to come on here and share with you guys a Michaels haul. Um, this is a collective Michaels haul. It's been over probably the past couple of weeks that I've been hauling. Um, and I'm trying to upload more consistently. So I figured this would be my next video. Um, I have got some really, these are old things. So you guys have seen them, but some really, really good deals on these. Um, wait until you hear the prices on some of these things. So, um, I guess let's just get into it. So, um, I don't buy wooden stamps anymore or if I do, they have to be like really, really, really cute. But, um, these are a part of their, I don't know, like their summer, spring collection. So I got this one, follow your heart, this cute cactus one. And I got this one. Um, guys, these rang up. Let me just tell you, these rang up for four cents a piece. Four cents. You have no idea how thrilled I was when I went to the scanner and I scanned them and that's what the scanner said. I literally, it just took me right back to those penny days, um, where we used to get things for like a penny um, and I couldn't even believe what I was seeing. So I was like literally replaying this in my mind. I'm like thinking, should I even take them up to the register? Because I don't like being, you know, I get really nervous because some of the, back when we used to buy the penny items, some of the cashiers would be really nice about it. And others would tell me, you know, no, you can't have them. But um, back then we used to be able to call, um, there was a corporate number that we could call and they said, you know, once it's out and the store hasn't realized that they're pennied out, if you put them in your cart, you can have them because the store didn't, you know, take them off the shelves or whatever. So I kept that in mind and I literally debated for the longest time whether or not I would go, um, whether or not I would go and get them. But I took my chance and um, I got them and um, I kind of told the cashier ahead of time that, hey, listen, these are ringing up for really cheap. Can I still have them? Um, and she's like, yeah, since they're on the floor, you can. She kind of had to call her manager and stuff, but they were really nice about it. So I was able to take these. But guys, four cents a piece. I just could not leave them behind because I'm pretty sure they would have grab bag this or who even knows. Back in the day, they used to just throw things out. So I did not want to leave them there. So those were some of the stamps that I got. Um, so I picked up these paper clips that I've been eyeing ever since they came out. They're just really cute. These are like those mermaid tails or whale tails or whatever. I got two packs of those. Um, some cats and I got some more. I got a lot of cats actually. Um, so I got six. So I actually, some of these clips I got, again, these were like, a 90% off they were four cents as well so some of these I got for the 90% off and then I think these three I got um, a couple weeks ago they like the end of August and they were like 80 cents or something let me just double check yeah these were 80 cent pieces so they were they're not even 90% off the original price they were like 90% off the discounted price because it was 80 cents, then it went down to like 8 cents, or 40 cents, then it went down to 8 cents. So I got an amazing deal on these, and I just figured I'm obviously not going to be using these, so using all of them anyways, but I figured for Happy Mail and all of that, so I picked those up. These as well were on sale, these Paper Flowers by Craftsmart. So I got like the mint, uh, the mint green, this like turquoise one, a light pink, and this really pretty beige one. And these were, I got these at the end of August, so they weren't uh, that cheap. I mean, they were cheap. They were like 80 cents, I think. So again, really, really great price. I mean, from $4, which I would never, ever pay. I wouldn't even pay half or 50% off, but for 80 cents, definitely. And um, I just figured these would be really nice to make altered paper clips. That's what I've been doing with a lot of my paper flowers. And I picked up this really, really tiny pom-pom, pink pom-pom set. And this was on sale for 97 cents. This was also another 80 per, or 80 cent item. The gems are coming off, but 
that can be easily fixed. So was so happy to find that. I went to a store that was like fully stocked with like a lot of these things before and I went again a couple days ago and they completely removed them so I think they caught on. Um, this was another 80 cent item. Again I'm not a cat person whatsoever but like for 80 cents I figured someone could enjoy those. These were oh I think this was four cents. Um, I don't even know. I bought things at like really random times. I think, yeah, these were like four cents a piece. So this is an older collection. I'm sure you guys, yeah, the glitzy collection. So this really huge sticker. Who in their right mind would pay $8? Michael's is just really ridiculous sometimes. So I got that. This really, really cute llama or alpaca, sorry. I don't know the difference. Four cents and I got this set so just really cute I was so happy that I found those um these are just some items that I got 50% off I went yesterday and they had their Halloween stuff already on sale which I'm so surprised we're not even in October yet um but 50% off and I just picked up some of these I've seen some ladies um haul white glittery pumpkins and they were in the States, and I don't know if Canada has got those, but I've been looking and I haven't seen them yet, and I'm so sad because I really, really like those. Um, but I haven't seen them, so I don't know, it's weird. And I picked up a pack of these really tiny doilies. I have doilies in my stash, but they're much bigger than this, so I just like the cute little round ones. And these are, I think, a dollar and change, dollar seventy-five or something. Um, this, I just ended up picking up it's a chipboard album and I believe I don't know how many pages there oh six pages and it comes with the rings and this I used a 55% off coupon so it was five dollars so I got it for two something and I just I really like embellishing these things it uses up a lot of paper which is my goal and I aim to do that um, recently I've been working on that and these twines were also four cents. So I got one of every color and they had, well, the one particular store that I went to had a lot left, but I just got one of every color because I do have a lot of twine already, but some of the colors I don't have. And I kind of like the solid twine. So I was able to pick up some purple, like some of the pastel colors, which is really nice. And with four cents a piece, I couldn't pass it up. Um, Michael's had their three, um, scrapbook papers for 99 cents, the 12 by 12. So I got chipboard. That's the only thing I got. I think I got like 12 pieces or something. These are really good for honestly, any type of crafting. Um, I've used these in mini albums. I'm using them in, um, just, they're just good to have to use for different crafts. Um, so yeah, I stocked up on these because I was kind of running a little bit low. Um, but these are always a great, great buy. And I don't, I was even telling my sister, I don't go to Michael's hardly anymore unless they have a really good sale. Um, so that that's one of the reasons why I went. So these are also a part of that glitzy line. So back at the end of August, I picked these up and I will tell you guys the price because it was unbelievably good. Where is it? These were a dollar sixty. So as you can see, the regular price is eight dollars. These were a dollar sixty at the time, and I was so happy that I got my hands on them. Um, I have glitter paper, but see, this one is slick glitter paper, meaning that the glitter will definitely not come off, making it easier to you know die cut and whatever. So I picked up this one. You don't get too many. I think you get 12 sheets, but I love the slick paper pad. I was so happy that I got that. So I picked up one of those. And then I got two. I got quite a lot. So I got this one. This is a Galaxy Glitz paper pad. Six sheets in here. And this was also a dollar sixty, I believe. 
So an amazing price. I mean, from $8 down to $1.60, it was great. And there's some really pretty colors in here. So I got that. So I got two of those. And I got two of these ones. So this is just another set. These are more like, they're kind of multicolored. I'll just kind of show you guys. Like, look at the pink. So pretty. Sorry for the glare. Really bad glare. And the blue. And these are slick as well. So they're, well, they're not glittered. So they're just kind of like specialty papers. But for the price, I could not. So I got two of those. And then I also picked up two of the slick glitter paper pads in the 12 by 12. So they're pretty much the same as this, just bigger sheets. And I figured for the price, they're honestly worth it. And this one, oh, this one is only four sheets. But the slick is what got me on this one. There you go. So I got two of those. So that's all the paper. Um, and then we're just kind of coming down to the last couple items. I got this glitter set at the time they had it. This was also another $1.60 item. Um, again, original price was $8, and I just love the purple. So pretty. You can put these in, like, the little hearts. You can put them in shakers. There's glitter. There's, like, the chunkier glitters. Um, just really nice to kind of have in my stash, and it comes in this, like, little case. So I thought that was a great price. Yeah, it was $1.60. Just kind of double checking. And then these huge bottles of glitter I picked up. They had a green left, but I figured I wouldn't really use green. These colors are kind of more what I would use. And again, this is $1.60 as well. So I was so happy to find these on sale. And they're the really chunky glitter. Glitter mixes. And the yellow is so pretty. Oh my goodness. And they're huge bottles. This is a really nice color too. So glittery. But yeah, that's what I got at Michael's. Um, yeah, I was so happy to find these items. I got such good deals on them. I was so lucky. Um, now I really have to like start using this stuff. Um, so I'm not sure if you guys remember, but a couple, I think it was in my last video, I mentioned that I had applied to be a vendor at um, a craft, the upcoming winter craft show, and I actually got accepted. So I am so excited. I'm a little nervous, but I'm really excited. It's going to be my first craft show. Um, so I've been doing like a lot of research on YouTube, just kind of like looking at different videos, kind of seeing how other people have been setting up their stalls, what kinds of things they're selling, um, what things they tried to sell but didn't sell as well so I've been doing a lot of research and I've been buying a lot of stuff so um just like different things to alter um so yeah I'm gonna be uploading I've been going to like Dollarama and Dollar Tree almost like every couple of days which is a lot for me so I have a lot of stuff but I really really gotta um start I want to create kind of a goal for myself and make a certain number of cards for example every you know every couple of weeks so I have enough things to sell. Um, it's in December. I don't know if I mentioned that already. So I do have about three months, um, which is a lot of time, but it also isn't because we're already like halfway in September, which I can't believe already. So I really just have to kind of buckle down and get organized and try to figure out exactly what I want to sell. Packaging as well. I have to um, get like all the cellophane bags and stuff and I wanted to order some stuff from Ali, but I'm not sure if I'm going to have problems with the shipping again because last time, I think last time I ordered was back in March and I ended up having to dispute a lot of my stuff because I didn't get half of my order, which is kind of upsetting. So I'm going to try again and hopefully I don't run into any problems. But yeah, I just wanted to share that news with you guys. I am so excited and I've been telling, you know, like my family and some of my friends, um, uh, at work and everyone's like really supportive and everyone wants to help so I'm so thankful for that but um, yeah I really got to get started on my projects that I wanted to sell and 
I'm going to be uploading a couple more videos just to kind of show you guys um, the different things that I've purchased. Okay, sorry for the rambling. I just wanted to share that with you guys, but I hope you guys are enjoying your weekend. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, guys. Bye. Hey, everyone. So I'm back. I actually thought I would do a hidden giveaway since... To be honest and to be real, I am not going to be using all the stuff that I hauled. Um, so I figured I would actually share it with one of you guys. So um, all you have to do is, well, first let me tell you what you're going to be getting. Hello. Um, you're going to be getting two sets of these cat paper clips. You're going to be getting this set of cat stickers. Uh, so you get 30 pieces in here. You get all of these stamps. So these three stamps, and you're going to be getting the paper pad underneath. However, I am going to be cutting it into six by six pieces um, just so that it's easier to ship. OK, um, so all you have to do is leave a comment down below. Um, it's Saturday night saying what your plans are or what you plan to do for the weekend. And if you're watching this after the weekend, what you did do on the weekend, um, do not comment or write saying enter me um, and kind of be discreet about um, about your comment like don't say you're entering the giveaway or anything just answer what your plans are for the weekend or if you're watching this after what you did do what you ended up doing on the weekend okay um, uh, yeah so you have to be a subscriber you're going to be um, 18 years and over and this is open to Canada in the US okay I'm sorry for my or if I do have any international subscribers but just Canada in the US okay um, so yeah leave a comment and I'm going to leave this open until I would say Wednesday so just a couple days I don't even know what date it is on Wednesday um, but just a couple days and then I'll do a video to let you guys know um, who wins? Okay, so good luck everyone and again, thank you so much for watching. Bye.